Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Nighthawk of the OG Loco and Nighthawk Show. Um, just wanted to let you guys know I got a Super Nintendo Classic. Uh, I'm really excited about that. Uh, we, I just walked in my rent my local GameStop and it was just sitting there on the counter and I was like, is that is that real? Is that a display box? Is that is that the actual thing right there? Can I can I get that? <laughs> um, and they were like, it, uh, let me check on my manager to make sure that it's actually able to be sold, not something that's being held for somebody. Um, and then also to make sure it wasn't a display box. He's like, he's like holding his hand over. He's like, okay, I'm going to, if it's heavy, then it's the actual thing. If it's not, then it's, you know, then it's a display box. Picks it up and it's heavy and he's like, okay, this is the real thing. Let me go check. <laughs> um, but yeah, that was, that was awesome. I'm glad Nintendo's decided that they weren't going to just make like one big run of the, the consoles and actually keep up production for more than, you know, like a minute. <laughs> Um, so we'll probably be either live streaming or doing some sort of videos with that thing just because it's so much easier to hook up an HDMI cable to my uh, Elgato HD60 than it is to hook up the class, the original Super Nintendo to the Elgato HD um, and then try to get the cable connections right and then you have to adjust other settings. It's just kind of a, I mean it's not impossible, it's able to be done, but it's a pain. It's a bit of a pain. So. I'm happy that I get to just hook it up to an HDMI cable and there's the game right there. All my classics, all the childhood favorites. The Super Mario World, games I never even got to play, like the original Mario Kart, or well, maybe it's not the original Mario Kart, but that's how bad I am on Mario Kart series. I didn't even know it was a thing until in the N64 days. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. It's going to be fun. I uh, hope you guys look forward to it. Um, we just did a reaction video for... The Last Jedi trailer, and I'll never use the Connect again for that kind of thing. It's got its uses. I mean, yeah, it's even Microsoft is discontinuing support for it practically. It's got its uses. That was not one of them. I would have been better off to just prop my cell phone and use that if I was being lazy, which I was. Um, so it's just. Um, our audio is just all over the place on the thing and it's really grainy footage but then that was also harshly because it was dark and I couldn't get enough light and I didn't want to set up all the light I had been up for like 36 hours by that time so I just wanted to do the reaction video and of course you only got one chance at a reaction video so <laughs> I mean we could do it again fake out the thing but it just wouldn't have been real so we just went with the first one um, and that's already got like almost 100 views, which is weird because like I literally put no, I mean, I really was lazy about that whole thing. It was like lazier than even this vlog. I mean, we just stood there and watched a trailer and that's getting 100 views and yet something I spent like four hours on editing and stuff like that. I couldn't get, it's still sitting, it's been on there for two weeks, like our Titanfall video, videos been on there for weeks now, 18 views maybe course then you got to think about you know okay there's probably a lot of people posting you know certain videos so we have to make that uphill climb to get up the ladder of all the other people who are posting the same kind of content so I guess there's a lot of competition so I guess like I get that but <laughs> it's a little disconcerting or discouraging when you uh you know you spend hours on one video it gets nothing and then you spend minutes on another one and it you know relative to our channel blows up I mean 100 views is blowing up for us that's some... <laughs> but I still appreciate the views I mean it's still cool but I just from a editing standpoint it's it's discouraging <laughs> but still excited for that movie it looks good uh, yeah I hope they don't kill off Leia although they kind of have to um, but goodness gracious there's a lot in there um we'll probably do like some sort of podcast or something on that video alone or on that trailer alone but um for now uh you guys just take it easy and i will see you next time